Alright guys, um, welcome to what I think I'm just going to call the knife room. Um, so, um, this is just going to be straight up about knives, because I have quite a few. Um, but don't mistake me for a terrorist, just because I look like this. I don't wear this in public, because that'd be, that'd be weird. Also, I'd probably get arrested for doing that. So, the first knife on this list is the Moonboat Practice Bow Song. This is really good if you, um... If you're a beginner and you just don't know how to use battle songs and you just don't want to cut your hands off. You could also just buy a real bow song and then tape the edges, but that's going to get a bunch of epoxy on your blade. This, this looks like a real battle song. It's not. It's Attack Force Spring Assisted. Um, Rainbow knife. It's pretty sharp, like this thing could cut paper. This is ooh, ooh, Gerber, ooh, baby knife. And then it's just, I think it's like a two inch blade. And then that's, that's that. This is literally just a dollar store switchblade. It's got a Phillips head screwdriver. Um, uh, little cork, and then it's got this non-functional file that's useful for nothing at all. It's got a knife, can opener, a bottle opener, a ah, pair, pair of scissors, I almost broke my number one rule and swore, but I didn't. Like I said, a pair of scissors. This not sticking together very well. And so you just like scissors, yeah. Scissors don't like to go in unless everything else on that side's in. And then there's this knife that I just found. It, it has this little thing, but nothing is engraved on it. It's got this blade, and then there's another blade that I accidentally broke. Just, uh, see, but I keep this, because, you know, why not? And there's this karamba that I got off of Amazon. This is very dangerous. I shouldn't be doing this, but... Yeah, so... This is karamba. This isn't... This isn't, like, you don't cut cardboard, or... This is... This is for, like, flesh. This isn't gonna cut paper or cardboard. Well, it will. It'll just dull it immediately. This is also a knife I found. It said bass fishing, but, um, I think you get what happened. So, this isn't my full knife collection. I have a lot more, I just don't know where they are. Uh, eventually I'll do a video on, um, battle song tricks. It's pretty hard to do it and still get it on camera. Because this desk is here, so my elbows can't go very far. But I know a few tricks that I'd be willing to show you. Like, oh yeah, one, one important thing to know is this. This is the, I forget what they call this, but this is like the latch handle. And it's, it's the not safe part, because if this was a real blade, 
this would cut you. Probably cut your fingers off, actually. But, like, you don't, don't ever hold it from this end unless the trick that you want to do specifically requires you to do that. And there's that, and yeah, so, I guess, I guess that's it. I really wish this video was slightly longer. I'm trying to pump out more content, but I don't have a functioning tripod for my phone, and I don't have an actual camera, and I don't have a cameraman to hold my phone. So... Yeah, uh, just lay these out, blades open, probably going to be the thumbnail. I'm not going to open everything on this because it's going to take forever. I'm not allowed to make any videos longer than 15 minutes for whatever reason, so i gotta, I got to make this short and sweet, but also, like, not... Uh, make it last too short. Yeah, so this is just all my knives. These two are probably the sharpest. No, actually I lied, this one's the sharpest. You you can't beat a, the ledge. You just can't beat it. I mean, it could beat you a lot, because, you know, it's gonna hurt if you get smacked by that. It actually doesn't hurt too bad if you don't intentionally do it. And I was intentionally doing it, it still didn't hurt, but... So I'm just going to close these, make this video slightly longer, even though I know no one's going to watch till the end. If you watch till the end, good job. Um, you, know who, you know who I'm talking to, Chad. You know who I'm talking about. Yeah, Chad. Better watch till the end. I'll, I'll beat you, Chad. Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, uh, yeah, try and pump out more content. You gotta pump out content every day. Otherwise, YouTube algorithm says, Nope, you are not good enough for my tubes of the use. Is that racist? I feel like this is an Asian name and I'm being racist. I don't care. My next video is probably going to be VR in real life if I can find a cameraman because I just, you know, you can't get a really good setup with like, like, especially if you're going to be moving around. <sighs> yeah. I guess I could do a review video later and then some gaming.